Matt was my first actual like youth group leader and he helped introduce like faith that I could practice it instead of just reading about stories like in the Bible. Looking back, one person who was a big influence on my life was Christine Martinez. She was my small group leader through forced home camps and it's such an amazing time. It's also a little scary because it's your first time away from your parents and it's really important that you're comfortable with your leader and Christine was everything and more than like what I would want in a leader. Josh and Tyler became my leaders in seventh grade. It was very good for me. One of the most difficult things that I've had to overcome was staying true to my faith throughout the years, especially going into high school. My second week in junior high, I met Michelle Clark. She's been my small group leader ever since. Tyler and Josh really kept us together to stay excited about church and stay true to our faith, even though we're going through such a drastic change in our lives. She told us the first like week that she was with us, if you guys ever need anything, call me at 2 a.m., I'm there for you. Um, I have definitely done that, and I think that most of us in the small group have. I learned not to really be embarrassed about like talking and practicing my faith in front of people. I realized that I could worship and not have to worry about what people say and really just focus on the relationship with God. Since my experience in junior high and high school with Michelle and with all of the pastors and people and camps, my relationship with God is truly my relationship with God now. And going into the real world as a college student, I feel like I have a solid head on my shoulders with the idea of what my faith looks like. Tyler and Josh were there from seventh grade until now, and they were always available at any day of the week to talk about whatever I felt like I needed to talk about. And I love them both, and I know this isn't the end for us.